What's going on, Silver Stackers? Our first edition of Wall Street Silver Epic Silver Stacks proved so successful, we're going to do another one. Alright, so our first one that we have here is a huge stash of junk silver, constitutional silver. We got everything from Washington quarters up in the top left to Franklin's in the bottom right. I like it. That's hundreds of dollars face value. Thousands, probably. All right, we got a little bit more diversity here in a stack. Looks like some kind of monster box of Star Wars rounds. That's interesting. Maybe a really big kookaburra up in the top left. A bunch of gold in the bottom right. Capsulated stuff in plastic sleeves and some big old bars to top it off. A bit of a smaller stack here. We got some Austrian Philharmonics, Canada Maples, Silver Buffalo Rounds, a Indian Head Penny, which doesn't have silver in it, and the dragon in the background guarding the gold, the gold maple, as well as the gold bar from Valkan V. Good Lord, can you imagine having so much silver that you need pallets in order to accommodate all the weight? Look at those shoes relative to the size of all those bars. Do the math, that is the silver stack of a lifetime. Okay, getting a little bit more reasonable here with a home stack. We got some kilo bars from Valcanvi Swiss, Royal Canadian Mint, maybe some 10 ounces here as well as some other Royal Canada Mint, Grizzlies, Predator Series, and Maples stacked up here in the center. Who doesn't like the Canada Mint? Now we're talking about a real stack here. Looks like maybe some Scottsdale Lion, Poured Bars. This thing's about to tip over, folks. Is that a Besker bar on the bottom? Those things go for a pretty heavy premium nowadays. All right, our first art piece maybe up here in the top left. Got some coiled silver wire. Got some buffalo rounds, some eight mex bars. Junk silver, both from the US and from other foreign jurisdictions. Not quite sure what those are. We'll look into that later. All right, some hundred troy ounce bars dead center. Looks like they're the Scottsdale lion there. Three of them. And we got stacks all around. We got some Kit Kats up top. More kilo bars. That's a lot of weight in silver. All right, what do we have here? A bunch of different generic rounds. I'm struggling to find anything that's a government minted bullion coin. I'm seeing some Brits here actually in the bottom right. Uh, we got an Engelhard Prospector right next to those. Some Australian Kookaburras. Big bars. This is an ape posted on Wall Street Silver. A kilo gold bar with what I have to assume are 100 ounces in the background of silver. A kilo gold bar, that's like fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000. Now this is a big home safe. Looks like maybe it's built into a basement somewhere. You better be hiding this. That looks like over 10 boxes, monster boxes of American Silver Eagles. Not sure what the blue boxes are. Let me know in the comments below. We got some Libertads, Brits, Silver Eagles, Maples, Kangaroos, Kookaburras, Greek Owls, and Krugerins. I like this stack. We got the East India Company bar up in the top right and maybe a uh, one-tenther Kookaburra. Or I, I apologize, Krugerin gold there. The gnomes threw me off. The gnomes guarding the Chinese panda, the kraken, the Krugerand, and sunshine mint generic rounds stacked up in the back next to the Canada maples. I don't know about putting my silver on display like this. Oh, this is the stuff of dreams. A tre treasure chest full of what looks like silver art massive quantities of government bullion coins and junk silver 
and the gold up front that is a stash a little more organization here we got monster boxes of maples we got monster boxes of philharmonics looks like maybe some of those have uh, junk silver in them not quite sure and of course the american silver eagle monster boxes on the right in that u.s mint green interesting some pure silver dominoes dice and a key to go with it i like it it's unique i don't know if i'd be buying something like that i have to assume he paid a pretty heavy premium back to the stack we got a precariously positioned balanced american silver eagle atop a pyramid of fellow silver eagles I like that. That's a pretty cool design. Okay, in the grid pattern here, we have kilo bars in the amount of seven rows and maybe 20, maybe 25 columns. I mean, we're talking 150 of those kilo bars. Look at this thing, Silverbacks Unite, banana for scale this is obviously coming out of wall street silver as well huge number of blue monster boxes black monster boxes kilo bars what looks to be 100 ounce bars and this ape claims they will not be selling below triple digits stacks here of the queen based on the obverse it looks like maybe we have some kangaroos and maybe we also have some maples we have American Silver Eagles, some cool dragons, and what looks to be Queen's Beast there on the left. This is actual silver stacking bars by the Scottsdale Mint. These are meant for stacking, and with a quick count here, we're looking at maybe 30 in a stack, 60 total. Numbers guy. This is the 100k special celebration for wall street silver bananas for scale multiple bags of junk silver above huge rows of bars and american silver eagle tubes congratulations wall street apes on your 100k subscribers which you've blown past and continue to grow even further that's it for episode two of the epic silver stacks come back next time